What's going on YouTube? I just wanted to make a quick tutorial to show you one of the awesome features of linked data types in Excel, and that is the fact that you can actually use linked data types to insert images um, with some of them, one of them being movies. So one thing to know as a background, linked data types is a new feature of Excel. Um, I think it came out this year in 2021, but one of the cool things is that you can actually insert the cover of the different movie titles So as an image. So here we have a variety of, of movie titles, um, 49 in total. And to insert images of the movie cover title um, using data types, first we need to make it the data type. So first we're going to have the data. Then we're going to go to the data tab, data types. Just click this little uh, more bo box right here. Then we're going to click movies. It's going to take a second for it to load. Now that it has loaded, you can tell that it is a linked data type by the little icon right here. And the question marks means that it just doesn't, it's not super sure on what you're trying to do. Um, you can see Titanic or different Titanic. So we're going to just select what fits the best. Um, some of them it's not necessarily going to find, but no. I'm just going to click, you can't find this one. So we're going to. First, change the title a little bit. Let's see if that will find something. Um, and if for some reason they can't find it, um, it's a little bit out of it. One thing you do is you can kind of like do searches and try to find something. So I like to find everything. Um, for the purpose of this, I'm going to just delete it and move it up. Because um, I just kind of want to show you how you can use this to insert an image. Um, but I could have continued to search and search until I would have found a movie title for this. So to insert an image, what we're going to do is going to click this little box right here, insert data. And as you can see, there's a lot of different uh, pieces of data we can in insert, such so as casting roles, company, direct to the genre, image, language, producer, production budget, rating advisory, release date, title, use total box of receipts, wolf and data type. Writer, um, just more, and for this situation, we're going to enter it, insert image. And we're going to want to make these a little bit taller. So Alt H O H for the height, call it 30. And then, kind of a better illustration, 100. So, and as you can see, here we have images of the different titles, which I think is really, really cool. Um, you can actually insert images and it can make your data that you're trying to look at or stuff that you're working on very much more visual. So we can also, for example, insert right here what was the international total box office receipts. What was the rating? And then you can also insert um, what was the total US box office receipts. So this is interesting because um, you can, can you can look at the rating. I'm gonna move this out a little bit. Um, kind of as a note. But you can then kind of compare, okay, so what is, so now we have an image, and we have an image of each of the movie titles. We also have the international box office receipts, the US box, the US box office receipts, as well as the rating. And this is just interesting because you can kind of visually see each movie. You can also see what is the international box office receipts and US box office receipts in the rating. So that allows you to kind of Dig deeper into your data, and something that would have taken you hours to research can be researched in just a few minutes. So that's it. I hope you found this useful. And if you did, like, subscribe, and comment. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day.